Welcome. In this class, we are going to be learning how to prepare turmeric and habanero pepper extract. Turmeric, as you can see me presenting to you right now, is very, very effective in combating diseases such as coccidosis, deworming, and uh, a whole lot more. Turmeric is almost like ginger, but it's different. That's why when you break it, you see it's yellowish inside it. So you can always get it. Now the first thing to do is to add water into our blender and then add the turmeric into the blender. As you can see now, uh, yes, you can add the turmeric into the blender and blend for a while before you add the your uh, your habanero pepper habanero pepper as you can see on the screen just now is uh, what we normally call atarudu in the yoruba palace or the fresh pepper yes the fresh pepper you used to make stew <laughs> that is what we also help that that is what helps us to battle with a couple of diseases such as crd uh, Cocidosis, even the warming of your birds. Turmeric mixed with habanero pepper or or black pepper helps to fight all this. Thing. Now it's time to add the habanero pepper to the turmeric being blended already. So after this, we are going to uh, add the uh, our black molasses to it but first of all the quantity of a habanero pepper we are adding now to the turmeric is just a hundred liter watt of a, a habanero pepper so i think that will be enough the it's actually very peppery and that peppery effect of it is what uh, helps to kill off all the a disease causing bacteria in the stomach of your birds. Uh, most time where you have a, uh, this also helps to fight E. coli so well. It helps to fight E. coli so well. Uh, if you have this in, if you add this to the drinkers of your chicken, they don't cough, they don't sleep anymore. So now let's add the black strip molasses. This black strip molasses, it helps to improve the taste of your medication and also uh, it's very medicinal to your birds and it also helps to extract the nutrients from the organic material we have just blended. So it helps to start fermenting them and bringing out the, uh, the, the harbor nutrient from the uh, organic material for a couple of while so it also helps to preserve the, the medication for a while so now uh, we are done blending that so what next we have to do now is to package yes we always need to package so right here now we have a jar a bottle jar that's it uh, we can use to package this uh, turmeric and uh, uh, habanero pepper extract so with the uh, mix with it being mixed with uh, black strip molasses you can be rest assured that for the next two months you can use this you can keep on using this medication without issues so we just want to st uh, rinse the a blender jar a little and then fill it into the container and then that will be all but however we are going to quickly show you how to apply it yes this is a, a three liters drinker and this three liter drinker is just an example you can use your discretion to uh, mix your medication into other sizes of a uh, drinkers. Well, however, to every three liters drinker, 
uh, I do recommend you use one teaspoonful of a uh, turmeric and habanero mixture. That is yes, a teaspoon. Yes, just use one teaspoon of turmeric and habanero mixture. That is it. You can see it's already coloring the uh, water. So that is just what you need. That is the much you need. This one where you place this water in the midst of your chicken, the drink of it and eat their food, you do not have problem with CRD. You do not have problem with uh, gumboro. You do not have problem with cocidosis. And you do not have problem with worms. So you've already dewormed your chicken. That is what it means. So this medication should be repeated twice every week, two times every week. You can give them today when they finish it. Give them plain water, and then repeat it.